Hi guys, it's Ray. Um, this is one of those team videos that's going to be completely off my normal topic. Um, a lot of their sponsored campaigns are clothing and stuff, and I've you've seen me buy a couple t-shirts here and there, but nothing too major. This is all clothing. I think they're calling it their curvy summer campaign. I don't know. I don't really need the titles on sizing, but um, I do believe everything I ordered is all the t-shirts I've been wearing. I think I've ordered two X's because I typically wear like an XL two X and somewhere kind of in the middle there. I think everything I ordered this time I upped to a three X. Um, just to see if the fit is better. Um, I don't really need a lot of clothes, but um, I wanted to test out some of their clothing. So everything is in its own individual bags. I did jot down the prices, but I haven't opened these yet. So I don't know what's going to come out of the bags in what order. And I feel like there may be an extra bag. So one of the two pack things might be in its own separate bag. So we're just going to jump in and find out. So, and I have now a whole bunch more of these bags. So this is a pair of like bike shorts, leggings, and these are probably going to be too big. Um, these I maybe should not have sized up on and I should have known better. Um, but they do have like a meshy pocket on the side. Um, I just thought for comfy shorts, for camp, for sleep shorts, or, you know, taking the dog out in the morning. Um, I'm not sure that I'm going to do a try on. I'm just not, that's really not me. But these ones were $9.89 and they actually feel nice. I mean, I'm wearing a pair of athletic leggings right now and these feel comparable in quality. They're not super see-through, so why not? But like I said, I probably should have sized down. So not sized down, but stuck to my regular sizing. I don't know what I was thinking. So we'll see. This is, I believe, the other pair of bottoms. This pair, I think, was listed as a bathing suit bottom. Um, yes. So this one was $8.99. But again, they're just little, like, summery shorts with a pocket. Um, but these are bathing suit material, so um, they have the little protective bathing suit. Thing. But this could be worn as a bathing suit or not, uh, just for casually hanging out at camp. Um, all of my bathing suits are like longer tankinis, so, and usually I wear skirts with them, but I figured I'd try these for up there, so. Um, these again, maybe I should have sized down. We'll see how much stretch there is, but they feel really high quality, really well made, double lined, so. Quite pleased with those so far. No idea what's in here. It's another black article of clothing. This is a bra. I've been watching people haul bras. I'm like seeing some cute stuff. I'm thinking, well, maybe I should try them. And then after I'd ordered these, somebody that I'd been watching um, actually mentioned their cup size. And I was like, oh, so we'll see. This one is lightly padded, lined, um, just a black. It actually looks very much like my pink bras that I do love. So we'll see. We'll see how the cup, I mean, it actually does look big enough at a glance. So I did size up though because of the cup issue. So this is actually a 4X. Um, because I need a bigger cup size. So, that's that. And that bra was $5.99. So, and this, I believe, is just a tank top. 
Yep. It's just a kind of flowy, um, nothing fancy tank top to layer. There's the back. This is the front. Just black and flowy. It should fit fine. It's kind of a, um, kind of like a polyester mix kind of material, but nothing fancy there. And this, I believe, is a two-pack. These are strapless bras in separate packaging, though. These were, the black flowy tank top was $8.49. This two-pack of bras was $6.49 for the two of them. They're just like tube top style bras. Um, strapless bras, nothing fancy. Um, just to throw on and go. Um, they should fit fine. I don't remember if I sized up in these or not. I don't like to go out and have my morning coffee. I can't put out a bra on or any of that. So, And my old go-to strapless bra that I could just put on. These I stuck with the 3X. So They're kind of a meshy material in the back. So they're very lightweight. And they actually feel really nice. So that is that. And then the other two things are just two more tank tops. This one was $5.79. I actually have a tank top that feels like this exact material at home. So, and I don't really know how to explain it. It's almost like a crepey material, but soft. So this is like a high-low strapless bandana style tank top. I chose green. I'll like it or I won't. I don't know if I'm going to try this on or not for you. I may take the white bra and this and try them on together just to see. But that was that. And then this one was $11.89. This one feels much heavier. Perhaps almost too heavy for summer weight, but again, this one's just a, a strapless little top. Pretty long. I mean, actually, this is supposed to be a shirt, but this is like dress length. So, I'm not too sure about that. I mean, I think it'll fit just fine, but I wasn't really looking for a dress. I was looking for a tank top. But this has like a floral border that kind of becomes more as it gets to the top. I'm also not sure how great the elastic is, but... And this is another one that I probably should have stuck to the two sizing and not sized up to three. So, that is my curvy clothing haul. Maybe I'll try just a shirt on or something. Maybe I'll put the shorts on. I don't know. I'll be back either way because I'm going to go try everything on and I'll let you know what I think. Okay, so this is that flowy black tank top. I definitely did not need to size up on this. It is plenty big enough, um, but I can probably just tie it off. I do have the bathing suit bottoms on with this right now. Um, they're actually a great fit. I love the little pocket, and I do have just this black bra. Um, I do wish that the padding in this bra was sewn in. Um, they're just kind of those loose floating triangles, and um, they have to be in there. Let's just leave it at that. So, But this is that tank top. Um, not my favorite, but I'll wear it. I'll bring it up to the lake and... You know, it can be summer wear up there. It'd be cute with just a pair of jean shorts. It's definitely long enough to go over even a pair of leggings if you wanted. So that is that. I will be back. Okay, so this is one of these strapless bras, which they're super comfy for sleeping in and popping up and taking the dog out. and That'll be great. Um, this shirt 
is, I'm going to say it's a bathing suit cover up. It'll be great for just hanging out and the black shorts are definitely a little long and a little big. I knew that though, as soon as I opened the package. But yeah, this is, um, this is going to be a cute dress for a bathing suit cover up. That's what it's going to turn into for just hanging out. Let me stand up on my stool so you can see. I mean, these bike shorts go basically down to my knees and you really can't see it under here. So, I mean, I could probably actually get away with this for just when we're running to the little restaurant just to throw on and go. So, but I do like the top overall. I should have definitely sized down though, but you know, just for hanging out and eliminating some tan lines. I'm kind of happy with it. So I'm going to go put the last shirt on and switch to the white bra and I'll be back. So again, super comfy. Um, I feel like where they sewed the elastic in, in this top is maybe slightly awkward. Um, but I just have that little white bra underneath here. And the shirt does have to come fairly high to cover that. And it does come down to like just above my jeans and the low part in the back. So I do appreciate that. But this is this one. Um, you know, again, probably just run out to dinner, or just hang out at camp. Um, not my favorite, but it's not bad. I mean, none of it's bad. It's all wearable. None of it's, you know, straight to the trash or anything like that. So there we go. That is everything. Um, this one definitely with a pair of jean shorts or something. Because it doesn't cover your butt. So if you're not into your butt and leggings, this is not a legging shirt. But, and again, I probably could have stuck to the 2X sizing instead of sizing up on everything. But that's my fault. Um, I don't have enough experience with their clothing, so, um, but yeah, I'm pretty happy with everything I got in this haul, so I'm going to wrap this up. I'm going to actually take this back off. I'm going to throw it all through the washing machine and pack it for the weekend. So that is it. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one.